From Jet 24, here's meteorologist Tom DeVecchio, your weather authority. It's 5.15, looking at uh, the big picture here in our new motors weather cam. Uh, this is looking out over Summit and Mill Creek. Uh, traditional look here uh, along Peach and I-90 and uh, up toward uh, Mill Creek into the lights, farther, close, farther out closer toward the lake. Good visibility, no problems. Uh, roadways in pretty good shape for this morning as no precipitation fell from last night. Temperatures have been bumping up. Uh, almost all of the weather watchers are putting temperatures that have gone up, oh, several degrees since midnight. And they're up to 32 here in Erie after being in the 20s. Summit Judy at 26. Edinburgh, Lori just updated us now up to 27 out her way. 26 in McCain, 24 for a Becky out in French Creek, and 30 in Lake City. Uh, we have 26 in Meadville and Sacred Town, uh, County Lake uh, up to 24, 27 out toward Linesville. Gary was 10 degrees at 2 o'clock, now up to 17, so uh, his temperature is going up as well. Uh, despite that, though, uh, of course, uh, one of the consequences of having a good southerly flow to warm the temps, it lowers the wind chill. Wind chill still in the teens to around 20 degrees, so make sure the kids are dressed warmly as they head to school with these uh, rather cold wind chills for the day. Otherwise, uh, wave off toward the north. Uh, may set off a few isolated flurries for this morning, but I'm hopeful that we'll see some sunshine for today through the flow on this relatively dry air. Uh, front that was going to move through for tonight. Kind of a similar situation uh, to last night, but just not as much snow. But we could get about one to three with the front tomorrow night. The lake effect for tomorrow will give us another one to three inches higher amounts in the snow belt. So we're not done with the snow yet, but we are getting a break from it for today. Outside of maybe a few morning flurries, very cloudy skies allowing for some sunshine and temperatures into the middle to upper 30s. But gusty winds still have to bundle up. And from your weather authority, snow showers uh, for tonight into tomorrow. And then you heard the accumulations generally uh, one to two for tonight and one to three for tomorrow. Uh, temperatures around 30. Then we keep it cold with some light snow or flurries at times for the weekend. It's 17 now.